at least 129 people were killed and 59 others injured during an attempted prison break in Congo, said Interior Minister Shabani Luku. The incident was reported at the nation's biggest Makala prison in the capital Kinshasa. It currently has between 14,000 and 15,000 detainees, according to official figures. Most of them are people awaiting trial, Amnesty International said in its most recent country report on the Congo. The provisional toll is 129 dead, including 24 by gunfire, after warning, the other victims have died by jostling or suffocation. There are also 59 injured people taken into care by the government, said Luku on X, Makala Prison, Congo's main penitentiary with a capacity for 1,500 people, holds over 12,000 inmates, most of whom are awaiting trial, Amnesty International said in its latest country report. The facility has recorded previous jailbreaks, including in 2017 when an attack by a religious sect freed dozens. Gunfire inside the prison started around midnight on Sunday into Monday morning, residents said. A senior government official earlier said only two deaths were confirmed during the incident, a figure disputed by rights activists. The prison has recorded previous jailbreaks, including in 2017 when more than 4,000 prisoners escaped from the facility after an attack by armed men at night. Authorities had been trying to reduce overcrowding, with dozens of inmates released in recent months. Justice Minister Constant Mutamba called the attack a premeditated act of sabotage carried out to undermine efforts to improve the condition of prisons. Investigations are underway to identify and severely punish those who instigated these acts of sabotage. They will receive a stern response, Mutamba said.